today is the ingredient for our video. We started with the main event stuff, grape leaf. You have cilantro, dill, parsley, onion, garlic, ground, ginger, turmeric, salt, pepper, cumin, tomato. That's the stuff leaf, grape leaf. That's the leaf, the grape leaf, and this is the rice. And the main event is the duck, roasted duck. And this is how we're gonna start it our video today in your olive oil, of course. Also forgot the saffron. We we'll soak it up in more with hot water. We're gonna need that and your pickled lemon we're gonna need that for the duck slicing the onion small size medium size After we add the six clove of garlic, now we'll slice in the pickled lemon. And we're gonna add that to the duck also. We're adding the shot pickled lemon to the duck. Adding a one teaspoon of ginger. I have a teaspoon of black pepper, one full teaspoon of uh, salt, and saffron to the duck. And we're adding one teaspoon of turmeric. And we're gonna mix all that together. And then we'll put it in a tray. And then we'll stick it in the oven. Inside, outside. Just rub it all the way through. The way the flavors in the season go inside the duck. With a little bit of olive oil in the bottom of the tray, and now we're adding the duck and all the goodies go right on the top of the duck, and we're gonna wrap it up. I'm gonna add one cup of water to it. How long are you gonna leave it in the oven for? An hour and a half. An hour and a half, and a little bit more olive oil on top. All right, guys, we'll boil this beef bones and we're making the soup. That's how you cook the leaf with. We just boil it for a couple minutes for like a half an hour. We're gonna throw it away. We're gonna throw this away and we're gonna start it again fresh, clean water. And we're going to throw the soup away. And we're going to start fresh 
water to wash it, and you just get a fresh crop coming out. Okay. Now we wash the meat, the bones I meant, and we're adding bay leaf to it, and we're adding raw onion. some parsley cilantro also and she added to the broth. Now we're adding milk, water, just a little, liter and a half. Liter and a half. Let it drown in the water. Let it boil for how long? Oh, like hour and a half, two hours. Mm. To get all the goodies from the bones. So it's like an hour, hour and a half. Cooking it. Some more water to it. All right, now we're making the mix for the stuffing. So we're adding a small cup of oil, veggie oil, vegetable oil, and we're adding a ground onion. So this one is big, big onion. onion. If you don't have big one, you can use two. Caramelize a little bit. Still, I'm trying to hide it. Get brown a little bit. All right. We also we done our tomato. We're waiting for the onion. Well, like a pound of tomato, and then we're waiting for the onion to brownish. Okay, now we're adding the tomato to it. Okay, now we're chopping up the parsley, dill, and cilantro. In the beginning of it right there, the, the one we just slice, the tip of it, we're going to keep that to put it on the bottom of the... How you guys call the hella? Hella. <laughs> <laughs> bottom of the, the pan. <laughs> and then we're slicing the stuff, chopping it fine. Sometimes you just lose it. Tomato. Now we add all of it: the dill, the parsley, and the cilantro. And then we drain the rice, and also we add in the rice to the mix. And you're gonna stir all the mix up. And you add your season, a teaspoon of black pepper, two teaspoons of cumin, two teaspoons of cumin. Ginger, one teaspoon. One teaspoon of ginger. And salt. Two teaspoons. And two teaspoons of salt. And you mix it up. Very good. In the meantime, we're checking on our broth, beef broth. There you go, you see it. Smoky, let's go back to it. It looks better now, it looks very good. We mix it. Now we're going to add this beginning of the when we chop the parsley and the cilantro and the dill. We're going to dump it in the 
bottom of the pan. And then we're going to put some garlic to it. So we'll put the parsley in the bottom of the pan. Then we'll put in some grape leaves. That way it doesn't stick and it doesn't get burned. Then we and then she just threw cloves of garlic in the bottom of it. And then you start rolling the grape leaf and stuff it in there. Let's start it. And that's how we stuff the grape leaf. Try to make it tight and smaller. That way it doesn't lose its side. There you go. That's one. Perfect roll. It's a working long process, but the result of it is very tasty. And God bless the hand who made it. That's my wife, of course. Thank you. Some people use a spoon, we prefer our hand. You're more in control. And we're gonna show you how we stuff it inside the pan in a little bit. Still continue rolling. It look nice, just nice setup. And you just keep going like that. Right, this is the finished product. Now we're just adding the soup to it. The beef broth to this. Good enough. All right, this is the final product here. We have the stuffed grape leaves. And we have the duck. We decide to make potatoes with olive around it. The duck look good. And there's the grape leaves with the roasted garlic. And this is the soup that we make earlier. The beef broth, I'm drinking that one. And this is the fresh bread we make at home. There you go, we say bismillah. اللهم بارك لنا فيما أعطيت وزدنا خيرا منه See you next time